Hello, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is from DIY Choose. They did send these items for review, so thank you to DIY Choose. So, first thing, let's do the, the different thing. This is a bracket hang-up ring diamond storage rack. I don't know. That's what they call it. DIY bracket hang-up ring diamond storage rack self-sealing hooks accessory set. Lots of words there. So, so this is, I think, the gold version. So it has this rack here. It came with some labels here. And it came with this nice set of labels, which I actually do have some. But now, I, hey, I have another set. See, this set of labels has one through... 99 and an ABC and then it has the DMCs with the actual color of the DMCs around it. So I've been using these for kitting down. As needed. All right. So then it comes with these bags. These are actually much bigger than I thought it would be. I thought the bags would be more like I don't know this size maybe and this is this this is like six by eight this is huge here it each of these bags are nine centimeters by 15 so a good size here and they're supposed to be 30 30 pieces of this and then there's supposed to be 30 rings. So this is, I guess, another way of kitting up. We'll see. Let's see. So it's these are zip bags here. So you can... Okay, first time opening must be hard. All right, there. You could put your drills in here. And let's see what these rings are. So... there and then you could put a whole bunch here and pick out which color you need huh that might work especially if you can re easily remove this and easily put it back like I just pushed that down and then if you push down it just comes off and it can go back in so so yeah that is some different way of kidding stuff up maybe you could use this if you have special drills and you like to keep them next to each other and you could go and be like hmm what color do i need that could be a way it's, it's kind of funny, the weird different things that we we end up getting, the, the, the different things that get thought of to use for diamond painting. So I wonder what this was supposed to be used for before. I don't know. So this set is $10.29. You can just buy the brackets alone, the, this bracket alone, and you could buy these bags alone. And you could buy the rings alone. And then you could buy the set for 10.29 and there's a black set a white set and a gold set this is the gold set here all right and in case you want to know this is about 19 centimeters wide here eight centimeters there and about 22 centimeters tall yeah the stuff that the, the, the different things that come out nowadays right all right 
And I had no idea what this was, so I had to I had to try it out. So you guys could figure out what it is. So you guys could know what it is. All right, let's move this. Next thing, let's do this here. This is a bookmark of feathers, of a feather, just one feather. So it does seem like it's a more flexible plastic here. So here is this feather here. There is a whole bunch of different colors of the feather. And this is $3.59. So ordinary toolkit, except it does include the feather accessories, the keychain accessories. So it doesn't seem, it seems like it'll be more with this jewel at the end. So I'll have to take out my, probably have to take out my jewelry making stuff. But you could probably just do it with plain old pliers. So this thing, let's see, is about 20 centimeters. And then at the widest, it's about six centimeters. And let's look at the colors here. Let's see. So there are some purple ones, some clear, some marquees here. And some clear marquees, yellow, clear, and then, ooh, these are pretty. This is why I chose it, because of these colors here. And this will probably be included in my several off-the-canvas things that I'm going to be doing so that I could give it away in Halloween, because I was very successful this year in giving away the stuff during Halloween. Okay, I'm gonna need the toolkit too. So I'm gonna put this back in here so things don't get separated. Why is it so much harder to put things back? All right. So this next item, I don't know exactly what it is. It said it was a sticker art. And that's why I got it. Anytime I see something that I haven't done before, I tend to get it so that I could show it since I do have this platform of getting these things. So ordinary toolkit with, except there's some black tweezers and okay, it's taped. It is a sticker. So it's a sticker of this ornament here. Let me. Yeah, it's a sticker. These ornaments here. And the sticker is, where's my measuring thing here? It is 17 by 24. And the drills. Some blue, green, oh, there's only, there's only like, what, six colors here. Blue, green, yellow, red, and clear here. So that should be quick to do. You know, I say now. <laughs> uh, 
Um, this, did I say this is $3.59? And there's a couple different kinds. I just got this one because I was like, I don't know what this is gonna be. I, I, I wasn't sure if it was gonna be a sticker. It did say sticker art. I was hoping it would be a window decal. You know, those ones that are removable. If you kind of just wet the back a little bit and put it onto, and then squeegee it onto the back of, on some glass. But I think this is actually a sticker, so. I'd be reluctant to do that. All right, but I'll still finish it and I don't know what I'll do with it, but it'll just probably go in my art portfolio. <laughs> All right, next thing. This is, it said it was brooch, brooch, brooch. Is that how you pronounce it? It looks like BR, I don't know if they, yeah, brooch. So I was like, okay, it's not a keychain. Okay, so it is, it has some, it's a pin. So there, pin. And it does look like I'm gonna have to stick it on myself. So ordinary toolkit, except there's a couple baggies. And five of those. But I get, I, you know, I think what I might do instead of doing the brooch, I might just put a magnet on the back, hot glue a magnet on the back and make the magnets. Cause I don't know, does anyone really wear pins anymore? I guess you could pin it to your backpack or something. Yeah, you could probably pin it to your backpack. But I got some animals here. So is that, is that a fox? Tiger, panda, zebra, a deer, and a lion. But yeah, I'll have to think before I'm gonna put those in there. It'll just, it'll be one of those. Oh, I have another one. It'll be one of those. Should I put the brooch? Should I make it a magnet? I might decide after the video. <laughs> and see what folks say I should do. So some clear here, browns and oranges, and some blacks, and then some bigger size. Ooh, googly eyes. I always like the googly eyes. Well, but yeah, I think this is the first time I saw the things they called the brooch. So I was, I was like, let's try that one. Oh, and these are $5.69, and there's a couple different kinds of things you could get. Like, I see some Christmassy ones, and I see some flowers, and you're like, Joan, you didn't get the flowers? Nope, I didn't get the flowers, I got the little animals. Because, like, I'm gonna give these away during Halloween. I have, I'm starting now, because I ran them out of everything. If you saw my video where I showed everything I was planning to give away in Halloween, it all went away. <laughs> so six and a half centimeters by five and a half centimeters. They're cute. <laughs> Heads. All right. Brooches. And last one is a diamond painting. It's a Christmas diamond painting. It's eight dollars and thirty-nine cents. It's this should be a round drill. Right. So ordinary toolkit. Okay, these look like they're in the baggies here. I've been seeing more and more of these diamond paintings come with the drills in the baggies. And here it is. It has these four snowmen that have different looks to them. They all kind of look a little mischievous here. And then the background says Merry Christmas. There, 
it's 45 by 35 and there is 24 colors here all the symbols look like they're letters and drill field it does look like there's a nice uh color block section of d here and a lot of i i must be the white Nothing screams out to me that it would be difficult to tap and paint there. And feels pretty heavy. Look at all this white here. Oh, straggler black. It's escaping. So I hope that doesn't mean that the black, um, because I see another black here. I hope that doesn't mean that the black bag is open a little bit. But I'm not going to touch this. <laughs> so I'm going to put in the number of this. It does say 2328 here. So I'm going to put the NH2328 there. And right. So that's the last one. I'm kidding. I'm unboxing for this video so let me move this move you up you can see all the stuff i got so there's this one here here are the animal brooches the sticker here the feather and then the hanging thing in there I will work on the the partials on in this thing and perhaps if I'm feeling festive you'll see this in the future. And that's all I have for now, so I'll see you later. All right, I'm back and this one is done here. This ornament sticker here. And this is a sticker. I still haven't sealed it. Need to see it. Um, so this is about a 16.5 by 23.5, and there was six colors, and they were all crystal rhinestones. And I only wrote that the green had two shades. So I think what the green, the green drill when I was diamond painting it, it was kind of a mixture of two greens, and. I just wrote that down there, but it's fine. It You can't tell that there's a mixture of green and probably that adds for realism, right? Realism. Um, and this took me one, eight, one hour and eight minutes to complete. And there it is. I'm not sure what I was going to do with it. I thought, you know, if I was one of the more crafty people, so while I'm doing this diamond painting craft, I'm, I don't know if I consider myself that crafty. Um, and you see all these folks doing like those... Um, DIY like Dollar Tree like hack crafts. I don't I don't like the word hack. Like those crafts where they get stuff from the Dollar Tree and then they make something from it and it looks it looks prettier. And I'm like that is something I'm like could I do that? I probably could, but I don't have that creativity to come up with a concept. So and that's why diamond painting is awesome because I don't have to be creative. Someone tells me what what drills I need to put into something. So, so yeah, there is this one here, which like, that's why I was talking about the craft thing because I was like, hey, I could do one of those things where you get like the pizza um, tray from the Dollar Tree and then you slap some, I don't know, Christmassy paper on top of it and then you stick this on top and then you put like a string at the top and then you put sprigs of stuff in it and you make like a, ooh, look at like, this nice looking sign. That, I've watched many of those videos, I don't think I have that talent. <laughs> or I just haven't attempted to do it. I don't know if I have the interest in doing it. But yeah, that's what I was thinking this could be used for, is like some, something like that. Because I don't know how removable this is. Yeah, I don't know how removable this is. <laughs> Alright. There's that one. And I finished these
They're cute. It has the googly eyes. Um, I'm still pondering. Am I going to do the pin thing or am I not going to do the pin thing? I still have to seal them, so... And I still have until next Halloween to decide, right? I have the, until next Halloween to decide whether I'm going to do... Make them pins or make them magnets because I'm thinking of just making them magnets because... Unless you unless you do the pin thing and then kids can like pin it to their backpack. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, perhaps you guys have some some opinions on that. So there so there's five did I write five? I have six. Okay. So maybe on the website it looks like there was five, but there's actually six because apparently I can't count. The picture has six. I don't know. I just probably typed it too quickly and did five instead. I could see that happening. So these were, there was 13 colors. One was a regular round drill, eight crystal rhinestones, and four specials. And this took me 59 minutes to complete. And they're cute. Look at, you can tell what they are. Zebra. Here's a panda. Lion. I'm not sure what this is. Is it a fox? That's my, my, that's my guess. Fox. We'll go for fox and reindeer or some sort of deer. Maybe it's probably not a reindeer. I don't know. How does reindeer look different from regular deer? <laughs> I think it's because it's it's like Christmas season-ish because it's almost Christmas. Oh, well, at least for me, it's, it's right, right before Thanksgiving for me. So, and here is a tiger. So there you go. Those are done, and they're cute. Let's move that over there. And I finished the feather bookmark. I do notice that it has this like plastic covering over it, which I will take off when after I seal this. Ah, uh, yeah, I have to seal. I can't use my spray sealers. It's too too cold because most of my spray sealers say to spray it between like this temperature and this temperature. And right now it's below the this temperature, the, the low temperature. So I have to do sealing it with liquid sealers, and I don't find that entertaining. I don't know. Other people are like, ah, it's not too hard, and I'm like, ah. <laughs> it. Someone at some point made a comment on my channel and said that I enjoyed every aspect of diamond painting, and I think I do, except for sealing. So that's the one part of diamond painting, for whatever reason, I do not enjoy doing. So, so yeah, here is the feather here. So what did I write? This is a 6 by 20 centimeter, 10 colors, 6 crystal rhinestones, and 4 specials, and this took me 23 minutes to complete. And I don't think I wrote anything. I put there, there was excess stick because it is really sticky on the side here. So that's what I mean by the excess stick. And there it is. It's really beautiful. I really like the specials for these here. Those look really nice. And it did come with this to put onto here, but I have not sealed it yet, so I didn't really want to put it on yet. So I don't know. It, it, I don't know why there's extra rings. Like I feel like I only need one ring, but I could always link all of them together or keep the rings for something else. But this one has, a, I think, a, ni a pretty nice book bookmark. Um, I don't know what you call that. The tassel. It doesn't look tassel-y, though. We'll call it the bookmark tassel, though, because I can't think of any other word. All right. So there is that finish. So that's all I'm showing. Here, here, here. So there's all the finishes for this video here. So thank you very much to DIY Choose for sending these items for review and the other items I showed at the beginning of this video. And thank you for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye.